We have um, a college counselling service. It's run by some of our counselling level five trainees and we offer six weeks of counselling just for young people to talk about what's going on in their lives and often just very just talking about things can help bring things under control a bit more. Each learner has an LDC and the LDCs will be uh, our point of contact for anything non-academic, non so anything that might be going on in your life that might be causing you anxiety and they could maybe meet with you one-to-one -one themselves um, and talk about things in your life or through the LDC and me as the LDC coordinator we could um, put you in touch with local agencies around the around South London so things like your GP who can get you into CAMS or uh, other services we go to somewhere called the Well Centre who are based in Streatham and they have GPs and counsellors and youth workers there um, and then there are other all sorts of different other places like MIND and other volunteer um, organisations that can help with counselling advice that kind of thing um, there are also some online tools that we send some people towards and something called IAPT which is improving access to psychological therapies which we encourage people to uh, to um, refer themselves to. So what advice can you give to young people who are not even aware that they are suffering from anxiety? Sure, I suppose it's like um, you don't have to feel really bad, you don't have to go through things on your own, um, talk to people, um, talk to, to talk to your family if you can, talk to friends, you know, talk to your LDC or tutors or anyone that you trust. Um, if things don't feel right or you feel, you know, differently to how you used to or things that you used to enjoy, you don't enjoy anymore or suddenly you're getting really worried about coming to college and you don't know why or, you know, all sorts of things, that can be a totally normal part of life. But also it doesn't have to be something that you just have to like live with and it could be something that you might be able to get some help for. Um, and obviously everyone feels anxiety, right? It's a natural human emotion. But if it starts to, if you find that the things that you normally do or normally enjoy or friendships that you have of something's going wrong with them, then, you know, maybe that's a point at which you can start to say, actually, maybe this normal thing, uh, anxiety, is becoming, like, a big thing for me. And now I'm, you know, the things I used to do are really hard for me to do now. So listen to yourself, talk to people, and just be open. And obviously one thing that people talk about is stigma and feeling, you know, like there's something wrong with them if they have anxiety or they've got something like, you know, anything they feel differently to how they used to and you know I just try and say that that's just not true like people feel that way and there is help available and to come forward is a, is a first step.